Now, when Hard Copy did a story on one doctor's miracle treatment and crusade to cure cancer, hundreds of people called him desperate for help. I can say with certainty that there are people alive today because they saw us on Hard Copy. We think that, that every patient is different and they are unique in their pattern of sensitivity to treatment. So if you're going to get the optimal outcome, you need to individualize the therapy. You really have to tailor the therapy. Welcome to the microscopic world of Dr. Robert Nagorni, a California oncologist many call a miracle worker. Nagorni saved my life. I know he saved my life. He's an angel. Tell that to his face, and Nagorni simply smiles. The laboratory can work miracles. I'm just applying laboratory uh, techniques. But without Nagorni's perseverance in the lab, hundreds of cancer victims would be dead. Chemotherapy is crude, painful medicine. It begins with that first stick of the needle. Chemotherapy is the injection of poison into the bloodstream. It attacks cancer cells, but it can also ravage normal cells. Often the first treatment fails, so another drug is tried, then another. That's because doctors simply don't know which of the 60 chemotherapy drugs will work in which patients. Dr. Robert Nagorni of the University of California appears to have a solution. Find the right treatment for each patient, but find it in the laboratory. Dr. Nagorni and his colleagues take a sample of the patient's cancer tissue and in a single test expose the cells to an array of different drugs. I have the luxury of testing 15 or 20 things in a test tube without the patient ever feeling sick from it. We think it is barbaric to treat everyone the same. I sent my son to him who had cancer as well and he is now in, in uh, remission. What Dr. Nagorni makes with me, it was a miracle. Other doctors diagnose the type of cancer a patient has and then prescribe a routine treatment based on the averages, which works okay if you're the average patient. We think his approach is something that every person who has cancer ought to investigate. 